If we can't, then we are as good as dead. We've located Lord Liu Bei. He's marching on Cao Cao. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. We've still got some fight left in us. I shall own the battlefield! It's impossible for an army to continue fighting on an empty stomach. Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. I knew you'd be coming this way. Prepare yourselves! All right. I need everyone to defend this area. We're going to secure this area. Everybody, forward! Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. I obey. I always figured you to be the one to stand in the way of my ambition. I will repay you for this defeat a hundredfold. Cao Cao managed to elude our pursuit somehow. However, it'll be some time before he can recover from this defeat. We have an excellent opportunity to build up our forces while the enemy's unable to move. This is our chance to make a play for the land. Don't think we've got away safely yet. Your head will be ours before the day is through. This is not getting any easier. We need to hurry to Sal Ren's side. Tell me, Master Guan Yu. What news? What's the matter? Did you not manage to find Cao Cao? Cao Cao appeared before me. That much is true. But I elected not to pursue him any longer than was necessary, and retreated. Is that because of the favor he showed you in the past? I repaid the debt I owed him from Shu Province in Guandu. I should have been freed from the bonds of honor. And yet, when I left Xu Chong, I did it without a word to Cao Cao. I cut down his officers and fled to be with my brother. Cao Cao forgave my ingratitude and allowed me to return home. I felt I had to repay that kindness. I understand the circumstances behind your actions, Master Guan Yu. But rules are in place for a reason. You were given a command. Regardless of the reason, you allowed the enemy commander to escape. That is a serious crime. I made my decision knowing the consequences. I am prepared to pay for my actions with my life. Wait, Jugula Young. Please, I beg of you, you must pardon him this once. Guan Yu, Zhang Fei, and I swore an oath. While we were born on different days, we pledged that we would die on the same day. If Guan Yu dies here today, we will not be able to fulfill that oath. Guan Yu will pay for his crime through his actions. Please, you must show him mercy. If you insist, Master Liu Bei, I am prepared to let this go. <laughs> <laughs> 